I would like to thank Ash and Lewis for sending me this story. And he, he posted it from um, Instagram where you have this man who's 21 years old and his name is Dylan Jarrell. We got another Dylan, so you know his ass is crazy. But apparently there was a woman on Facebook who reported this man put out a racist message. And by her reporting it, she potentially saved a school from being shot up by the same exact guy. So her quick instincts helped her to not uh well help to not have a school shooting happen. I'm gonna go ahead and read the story. It says in one of the messages the suspect, 21 year old Dylan Jarrell, allegedly called the woman a wannabe black woman and told her he hopes her black children get hung for you being so stupid, Cole Burl Bull, the woman who reported Jarrell to authorities. Oh now I know what this story is about. Okay. A couple of my subscribers have sent me a story about this, but I didn't know the full extent. Now, now I think I know where this, where this is headed. Okay, so apparently, let me see if I can pull up. Let me uh, see if I can pull up another uh, picture. Hold on. Okay, so you see this woman right here. This is well, clearly the woman in the middle is white, and the three kids around her are her kids. Now, let's be real here. We all know that the dad got to be black because look at them kids. Them kids could not pass for for white. If I saw them on the street, I would say, oh, they're black or they probably have something else in them. They're probably, you know, mixed or whatever, but they couldn't pass for anything else. But anyway, so this woman has sent out the um, message or something like that, and he made threats against her. Now, I believe this uh, woman is in Jersey if I'm not mistaken. And she saw the message from this guy who I just had on the screen, and he's all the way in Kentucky. And he put out that message about wanting to shoot up a school. She saw it, and then that's when the back and forth between her and him started. And that's how it led to him being arrested. But let me continue reading to this. Reading this. It says the um, woman reported Jarrell to the authorities. It says other messages allegedly read, there's no such thing as white privilege and please you and your monkey children go die. Bull, who is white, reported the messages because she was worried about for her three biracial children, she told the Post. While Bull's Facebook page shows her with her three children ages 8, 11, and 16, she does not know why Jarrell targeted her, she told the newspaper. I think it was pretty obvious he targeted her because... He's racist. He probably sees her as a traitor because she had the nerve to sleep with a black man and have and produce these children, which he and most races would consider an abomination. Concerning Post, police encountered him as he was backing out of his driveway Thursday afternoon and found evidence of a credible and imminent threat to the Shelby and Anderson County School Districts after interviewing him. Officers also found a firearm, more than 200 rounds of ammunition, a Kevlar vest, a 100-round high-capacity magazine, and a detailed plan of the attack in Jarrell's possession loss and said. Now, the reason why the article that I'm reading from seems broken up is because there's screenshots in there. In a, um, if, you're, if you have Instagram, it's in a slideshow type of effect, so that's why the article seems broken up. But the person who um, put, posted it pretty much got the, uh, the main points. So this is the story right here. So I was going to do this story anyway, but it, now it's like it's kind of going backwards instead of it going forwards. But it all leads back to the same thing. But I mean, she saw something and she said she had to say something. So this woman all the way in Jersey got a guy all the way in Kentucky. And that guy is supposed to be 21. Hold on. Let me pull his picture back up. I don't believe for one goddamn second that this guy is 21. He looks older than me. But I guess, but you know, I guess I, you know, I got to give her her just due. She saw something that was, could have been a threat and she stopped it from happening. I mean, what else could I say? But y'all let me know what y'all think about this story down in the comments. Like, share, subscribe. The links will be in the description. I'll talk to you in the next one.